Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on multi inventories. So this is a really useful plugin if you have a server with multiple worlds. So if you have a creative world and a factions world and a survival world, you don't want them to have all the same inventories as players could just cheat uh, by getting diamond blocks from the creative world. So what this plugin does, it separates uh, each world or worlds into groups which share inventories. So as you can see here, I am in a random world with very little health and hunger. If I teleport to my other world, you will see that um, it saves the uh, hunger, health and inventory in the other world. So if I go into game mode 1, you will see that in my game mode 1 inventory, I have loads of diamond, uh, oh, golden apples, I mean. And uh, if I go into game mode 0, they will disappear. So even if players manage to get into game mode 1 for some reason, they won't be able to cheat and um, go back into game mode 0 with the same inventory, which is a really cool feature. I haven't seen this before in a plugin similar to this. So uh, I've heard there are problems with multiverse inventories, that it doesn't work with 1.9 or it's a bit glitchy. So this is a brilliant uh, alternative to use. So uh, you can download it for free off of Spigot. But for now, we are going to go into the config file and see what we can edit there. So here we are in the plugins folder, and as you can see, there are four different files. So let's start with the config.yml, and as you can see, there are some very useful things in here. So you can turn off splitting health and hunger, which I would recommend you leaving on so people can't cheat or anything like that. Control game mode, that is very useful to have on. Separate game mode inventories, which is a fantastic feature haven't seen that before and a list of all the creative groups so um, this is one of the groups I have in the other file then you can obviously have a MySQL database if you really want to so let's go into the groups file which is also very useful so here we have the creative groups um, group and in here we have all of the creative worlds and then we have another group up here it's very easy to create um, another group you just copy and paste one of the previous ones so you could create like a VIP group if you wanted to and uh, this could have all the VIP worlds in if you, your server had something like that. So survival VIP and maybe nether VIP. So all of these would share the same inventory. All of these would also share the same inventory and be creative. And then all of these would share the same inventory. And then finally the last file, you don't need to mess around with this. This just logs where people logged out. So that is the plugin. As I said, it's really useful. You can download it for free off of Bucket. And this plugin was brought to you by Gaelic Craft, a fantastic townie server. So check everything out in the links below. And I'll see you next time.